Hi, thanks for dropping by. I'm Zelda Sheldon with loveyourvoice.coach and today we are going to be looking at rejuvenating tired voices. I know this is something that affects so many people, especially if you use your voice a lot. We'll also be looking at how to take those super quick breaths in the parts of the song where there's just no place to take a super quick breath. <laughs> We've got a fantastic artist with us here, TJ Carter, and she'll be singing, playing guitar on one of her original songs, and we'll be using the voice coaching tools that I use in my Love Your Voice coaching sessions to help with rejuvenating her voice and helping her take those super quick breaths. Before we go there, if you're interested in joining our Love Your Voice community, it's so easy. Just email me, zelda at loveyourvoice.coach and when you do, I'll send you one of our fantastic singing resources. It's called The 12 Mistakes Professional Singers Avoid. So now let's go and check out the session. All right, so now I would love to introduce TJ Carter. TJ is here with a cup of tea. I am. It's helping keep my throat warm. It's amazing. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> and you're going to sing a beautiful song for us, and we're going to see if we can I am. use the tools. And after listening to your introduction, I think I need a copy of the 12 mistakes to make as well. <laughs> Very good. I'll be happy. You know what to do. Just join the community. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. So, TJ, um, just... Help, um, help the viewers, help the listeners, help the watchers uh, know a little bit more about you. Where are you based? Where are you from? What sure. do you do? Sure. So I've taken multiple lessons with you mm -hmm. um, prior to today, and um, you asked me to come and do this, and I'm more than happy to. And when I showed up today, I was telling Zelda um, just that I had a, a three-hour solo gig over the weekend, um, which... When you play solo and you're singing for three hours, you, it's very taxing on your vocal cords. Um, yeah. And then I had a, a session. I uh, sing demos here in Nashville for different songwriters, which I absolutely love doing. Um, but I, I actually did two songs um, yesterday. And so my voice is really tired today. So when I walked in, I said, this is going to be so great because you can help the people watching um, if they have struggles with... Um, What's it called? Taxation on your vocal cords. I really. just call it vocal fatigue. Yeah, yeah, if they have, if they struggle with vocal fatigue, which I do, um, mm -hmm. just because you know you get a lot of work sometimes, and especially in the music industry, you can be like laden with so much to do, and then you have nothing to do, and in the times where you have so much to do. Um, you have to know how to rest, how to warm up, mm -hmm. um, things that you can do to really help. Um, relax your cords so that you can get through those times where you have a lot to get done. So over the weekend, I had a lot of stuff to get done. So my voice is actually very scratchy right now. Um, and I know that it's tired. Uh, I can feel that it's tired. It feels dry, which um, I know is inflammation, right? When your vocal cords feel dry, like you just can't wet them enough. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. So honestly, the tea feels really nice. The warmth yeah. feels really good on my throat. Good. Um so thanks for making that for me. That's okay. <laughs> yeah. But um, yeah, so I play around town and like I said, I played last weekend and um, I write music and so uh, tell Zelda... them where you Tell them where you play. So you're down on Broadway, which is the yeah. bar? So I played the Stillery last weekend. Okay, good. Um, and Plug for the Stillery. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> on 2nd Avenue, they're also in Midtown. Yeah. Great little spot. Um, I Great. covered a ship for a friend of mine. Um, and then, uh, yeah, and then for sessions, I just do it out of my home, you know, you kind of wake up in your PJs, pour a cup of coffee and love it, listen to a song and you get to pretend to be a famous singer. So that's awesome. Yeah, that's great. TJ, <laughs> but, now what song are you going to sing for us today? So the song that I brought and I was telling you, I was having a trouble, like trying to find a song. Mm -hmm. Um, it's, it's actually, it's a song that sits right on my vocal break. Um, mm -hmm. so that's why I brought it to you because I'll be yep. going back and forth between my, my, like a blend in my chest voice. Um, and it's called let out your color and I wrote it, um, right when COVID hit. Loving you is like a rainbow There is magic in the way You 
take my breath away And your treasure's so much richer The longer that you shine Your smile brings peace to mind So hold on to your dreams a little longer Cause through the deepest of waters Come take my hand together We will stand forever Light it up, light it up Recognize there is no one like you You were born to speak the truth So let out your color You were more than enough When we love one another There's so much beauty to discover So let out your color Color, color, color Every heart is like an ocean Fast and filled with brilliant things Only you can give them a wings So come on and fly above the fire You are perfect and you're kind You just gotta open up sometimes And hold on to your dreams a little longer Through the deepest of waters Come take my hand together Recognize there is no one like you You were born to speak the truth So let out your color You were more than enough When we love one another There's so much beauty to discover And let out your color Color, 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 color Let out your color, 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 color Let out Let out your color, 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 color Don't be afraid, I'm with you And only you can do what you do So we can paint that sky I just ran out of air, that's okay You're gonna, you're gonna tell me through that So let out your color You are more than enough When we love there's so much beauty to discover And let out your color Color, 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 color Let out your color, 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 color That's the gist of it. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. As you can tell, there's a lot wow. of uh, parts to that song, you know, and so, like, uh, where to get breath, you know, things like that. Um, mm. You could definitely probably... Give yeah. me some pointers for sure. <laughs> <laughs> and we, I love, uh, there were so many things about that song that I just loved. Oh, thank you. Well, I love the message for a start, but that's beside the singing. Yeah. But isn't that beautiful? Like, thank you. So, it's so uplifting. Um, I loved the power. I loved the power through that, like especially when you got to that, you know, big, yeah. that bridge. That's where yeah, the big, yeah. what? The build. Yeah, yeah, the build, yeah. Yeah, that was great. The melismas. Um, those, you know, little runs, some people That's call what them. a melisma is? Mm -hmm. Okay. That's what a melisma is. <laughs> I was like, I didn't want to be like, what's a melisma? And everybody watching be like, oh my gosh, she doesn't know what that is, but I don't. So, okay, a run. It's okay. You know how to do it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so that, uh, da -da 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 -da, let, uh, what was that? Let. Oh, let. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Let. I'm really bad yeah. at melismas. Da, 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 da. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five. So, yeah. let. so that's yeah. a five note melisma that you are doing okay. really well. Oh, so thank good. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, so the power, um, the uh, those melismas were great. Um, I loved it. I really loved it. Thank you. Mm, so much about that song, which is great. As a performer, it's a real showcase for your singing. Yeah, like I said, it sits right there, like between my bell and my my bridge. Mm -hmm. You know, yeah. I'm definitely going like high and low um, on it, and um, it's like a like a power pop song in my mind. Mm -hmm. So, um, but you've got so much knowledge. Come on, help me out here. All right, okay, okay. <laughs> so what I what I noticed about that song was there wasn't much room for breath. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. So it's one of those, what do they call it? Syllabically dense. Yeah. Lots of syllables, lots of words. Yeah. Um, 
very typical of your modern song. The modern yeah. pop songs have got a lot of words. Absolutely, yeah. Yeah, and so it's a challenge of where to actually take that breath. Right. So um, now we could do a couple of things today. Okay. So now we've, we've learned how to do the breathing, right? So you know how to do the relax, open, drop. Yes, yes. Yeah, so you can get that really quick bit of breath. But so, for people who are listening, maybe all right, if let's, you want to explain it. Yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. All right, so let's just do a very quick. So what we do is we do that backwards passive breathing. Okay. Uh, and so we just put our thumb tips together, put it on our navel, about a ping pong ball below that. Just push that back towards your spine mm -hmm. as you exhale. Right, and now just pop that out with three words. Relax, open, drop. Yeah, without a suck. Okay, yeah. without a suck. Yeah. Silent. There. So that's giving you all the breath that you need. All right. Okay, so that's the easy one, and that's courtesy of the late, great Renee Grant Williams, who has recently passed. Oh, okay. Yeah. So um, she used to teach all of her superstars um, that technique, which is her backwards passive reverse breathing. And so it's really helpful for when you're doing those sections where there's hardly any room yeah. for breath. Yeah. And particularly at the beginning of the actual, the very first word that you say. So what's the first word that you say or sing in this song? Loving. Okay, and what's the, the note? Word. Loving you is like a rainbow. Beautiful. Okay, so let's try that in application with the reverse passive breathing. Okay. So. Loving, loving you is like a rainbow. Okay, how was okay. that? That was good. Good. It was good. It's weird. <laughs> I mean, the, the passive breathing idea is like, it's strange because you think you have to go, <gasps> yeah. you know? And I mean, every singer, I think, thinks that. Mm -hmm. So it's like, it's a more of a mind game, I think, than a physical thing because you just naturally do it. But like, yeah. you, you know, but you're going, you want to go, you know, yeah. before, but. <sighs> but it's totally passive. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Loving. Yeah. Loving you is like a rainbow. Right. Yeah. Was there any difference? Well, I think the biggest difference is um, probably where my diaphragm sits because I can feel that I'm like actually pushing the air out mm -hmm. when, as I'm singing. Right. Whereas like if I go, loving you is like a rainbow, nothing is engaged here. But if I'm doing that passive breathing where I'm... Loving you, like I'm already, because I'm like um, pushing like pushing and relaxing, I'm already engaging the muscles, I guess. Right. So when I start with that first note, I'm mm -hmm. already like very engaged and much more supported. Good. So. Good. Yeah. Yeah, so it helps you with it your support. It sounds like I practiced saying that, but I did it, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> I think they knew what you mean. They knew what you mean. Um, now, the other thing, let's talk about fatigue. Oh, no, 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 before we go there. Okay. What's that really, uh, the part where you really need to get a quick breath? Yeah. Where, yeah, where is that? Is it the bridge? bridge. Don't no. be afraid, I'm with you, and only you can do what you do. So let us paint that sky. I just run out of there. <laughs> Well, that is a really long run. It is a long run. I feel okay. like I can do it. I want to practice it one more time. Okay. Sorry. All right. All right. Okay. Uh, and use, <laughs> use your backwards passive breath. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Don't be afraid. I'm with you. And only you can do what you do. So let us paint that sky. I did it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so all you had to do was just get a really big, full breath, and the easiest, yeah. quickest way yeah. is with the backwards passive Absolutely. breathing. Yeah, it's so easy. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Now, and I think too, like you know, um, I'm just going to talk about it because there's people watching, but nerves okay. like kind of get in the way oh, a yeah. lot, and so. Yeah. You know, I'm playing this song and I know that like we're on camera versus like, I, like, so instead of like relaxing and just getting a nice breath, it's mm -hmm. hard to relax when you're nervous. And mm -hmm. so I think that probably played into it too. Cause like, obviously I wrote that bridge. I know I can get that mm -hmm. run, but I just wasn't relaxed enough because I was so nervous. Yeah. So. And remembering also to use the singing tools to yeah. use that breath. 
Yes. Because sometimes, like, in the heat of the moment, like, with all the pressure and the nerves, yeah. like, all of the training is like, did I actually learn anything in any of my yeah. singing lessons? Well- <laughs> <laughs> because yeah the nerves so um i always say um the enemy of a great voice is tension yeah and so as soon as we've got nerves or tension out goes all the training all of the yeah. disciplines they just go out the window and we're stuck with like a nervous ball of energy yeah yeah, yeah i can agree there i'm holding up the remedy for a My vocal, vocal fatigue yeah <laughs> So as you can see, okay, so we're going to do it in three parts. Okay. And I remember when I had a series of 10-hour gigs, I used this a lot. So this was something that Professor Tizé uh, introduced to me and a lot of the vocalists around the world uh, have just gotten onto it. He's a yeah. vocologist. Okay. So you start with um, um, we're going to sing Happy Birthday or we're going to sing the national anthem once through the kazoo. We're going to do it through the kazoo buzz. So it's okay. like this. It's like a v r w. So it's like v. Let's do that. V. Let's do the national anthem. V. 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 Just do that part. All right, so say hello. You know our national anthem. I do. I know too. <laughs> I know the Australian one and the American one. Awesome. All right, so let's just say hello, hello, hello. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, and now what we're doing is we're trying to listen and feel for any difference that this kazoo buzz is going to do with our voice. Okay. Did you feel a little bit of relief then? I do, actually. I feel hello, hello, hello. Vroom. So for me, um, when I do the kazoo, vroom, um, I feel it like here in my ears and I can mm. feel like the, the vibrations coming down like this. Mm. So I know that it's like um, in mm. a way like a massage, you know, vroom, but like a really fast like, yeah, you know what I mean? Um, so I think that's probably really good because then I have to loosen up all those muscles with that. Mm. You know, yeah. it's hard to like really be tense and make that noise. Mm-hmm. Um, so it's more of a softer. And I can definitely like, I definitely feel it in my ears. That's so weird I to say, but I feel it like. <laughs> well, let's do Mark 2. Okay. Let's see what this does. So okay. um, I always carry a straw. Actually, there's this little thing called a, a little gig bag. And I have a little half full bottle of water there. It's got my name on it. Mm -hmm. And so uh, I can just recycle. It's half full of water. And I'll show you what we're going to do with that in a minute. But see this straw? Yes. I like a stainless steel straw to save the planet. Yes. We're going to do the the national anthem through this. Okay. Now. Without uh, this. Without this. We're going to do that in a minute. Okay. So. Um, I have water in my straw. That's okay. Sorry. Okay. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. Does it hello. feel lighter? You know, it feels better, but honestly, yeah. I think the the most the best thing with this is so the kazoo for me, I feel the buzz like out here. Mm-hmm. Um, when I blow through the straw, it brings it like towards the back of my mouth, like where my tonsils are. Good. And I can feel that. Good. And that feels very soothing. Good. Um, Good. Especially because my voice is tired right now. Um. Anyway, I, I'm just always trying to, like, engage with what I'm doing to know, okay, like, this is how it should feel when you're doing something that's healthy for your voice. Absolutely. You know? So, yeah, I really do enjoy just the straw. Good. Now, let's do Mark 3. Okay. Stick it in the water. Okay. So, it's a half full glass or a quarter full glass of water. Uh, and we're going to do what we used to do when we were little kids. We're going to blow into our water. 
Remember our parents yeah. used oh, to yeah. say, stop doing that. Oh, yeah. Right, right. so this is going to be good. <laughs> and what we're going to notice is the pressure that we have to put into the water through the straw is going to create this little aerodynamic massage. And we're it's, just blowing or We're just we going to sing the national anthem. Okay. Hello, yeah. hello. Hello, hello. How does your voice feel? Smooth, silky and sexy. Light, <laughs> light. It's amazing, yeah. isn't it? It's actually really nice, yeah. I, I think you have a benefit, though, because your cup is, like, closed, so it wasn't splashing <laughs> everywhere. Mine was, oh, like, splashing. Mine was splashing. Mine was splashing. <laughs> <laughs> and I only gave you a third. So that's yeah. what you can do, TJ. So um, get yourself, like, this is all about self-care. Yeah. And so what I did with my 10-hour gig, <laughs> it was crazy, but, you know, they paid really well. So I, I negotiated uh, to have um, uh, 50 minutes of singing and 10 minutes of rest. So every hour I had 10 minutes to do of this. just vocal rest. And I'd do this. Good thing is you felt it. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And that was like what? This was great. Like, this is a great tool. Yeah, so... You've actually done it. You actually did a couple of things with the breathing first. Yeah. So we actually got you to be able to take that really powerful, deep breath that you yeah. needed for that extremely long run. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, thank you so much, TJ. Now, um, tell people where they can follow you, find you, yeah. hear more about you. Sure. Um, I have a website, tjcartermusic.com, but... Um, Facebook or Instagram at TJ Carter Music. You can find me. Say hi. Fantastic. And if any, anyone wants to hire your brilliant vocal, what can they do through your website as well? Reach out to you and say, "Sing my yeah, song." They, yeah, they can. They can reach out to me on my website. Yeah, absolutely. If Fantastic. yeah, if you're a writer and you need a vocalist for sure. Great. Um, or they could even just message me on on Facebook. I'm. I'm yeah. Either one. Awesome. That's great. Well, thank you so much, thank TJ. You. Thank you for being willing to do this. Your yeah. voice sounds amazing. Thank you. Yeah. And so this is going to help it. This is going to help it even be more. Great. Yeah. And you made me tea. So, and know. we made you tea. <laughs> well, I hope that you liked that. Um, I hope you got some enjoyment out of it. And I hope that it really helped you um, as a singer. Now, I've got um, students who are teachers. Uh, and so they're in the classroom all day. Um, teaching, classroom teaching, and they love the kazoo straw. They love the kazoo buzz. They love just singing, just um, putting a straw into their mouth and then putting it actually into the little bottle. So maybe that's what you can do for yourself. Do your voice a favour and just get yourself a little um, kazoo buzz um, with a straw and um, start protecting your voice. So before I go... Just another reminder again to uh, join our community. It's all free, the loveyourvoice.coach community. Um, we're going to send you a free gift, which was that um, 12 mistakes to avoid, 12 singing mistakes to avoid. Um, so, yeah, take advantage of that. So um, we'd love to give that to you. And um, how you do that is just go to um, email zelda at loveyourvoice.coach, C-O-A-C-H at the end. So um, we're going to do a few more of these videos. We've got some other guest singers. So, um, yeah, if you join up our membership of Love Your Voice Coach, you will be first to know when we're going to be posting our next lot of videos. So this is Zelda signing off, and I hope you get to join us again. Bye. TJ. Let's do the big bye. Bye, everyone. Bye. <laughs> Thank you for watching. That was great. I love that. Recognize there is.